You have to understand something. Success is 90%, 90% a mind game. Yo, what's up you guys? Let's talk about something in this video and it's success. It's making money online, it's creating your dream life, financial freedom, achieving your goals. Here's the thing, success is not easy. It takes work, it takes dedication, it takes commitment, all right? And so I wanna talk real quick about this. If, if you want the shortcut to success, if you want to cut your learning curve and have success within this next month, this video is not for you, okay? This is a wake up call. This is a wake up call for so many people. Success takes work. A lot of people wanna come online, they wanna start an online business, they wanna become a millionaire, they wanna make all this money. Great, we all do, but here's the thing you guys, the faster that you can figure out, the faster that the light bulb goes off that says, you know what, this is gonna take some work. This is going to require me to change my thinking a little, little bit. Maybe invest into some, some personal development in understanding that your mindset needs to change about what it's gonna take for you to create success. The faster you're gonna get results, all right? Here's the deal, it's going to require work. A lot of people out there want success overnight, they want it now, they want it now, and guess what? Having that mentality is literally setting yourself up for failure. Why? Because it's setting yourself up for disappointment and false expectations, okay? Can you make money on the internet? Absolutely. Here's what I tell, here's what I tell people. Choose your hard. For those of you that hate your job, you wanna quit your nine to five, you, you, maybe you're just looking to make a couple thousand dollars a month. I know that that would help so many people out there. All right, and a lot of you, you know my story, right? How, you know, I was working paycheck to paycheck when I first started my online business and now been able to make a multiple six-figure income working part-time from home. Maybe that's not for you. Maybe you don't want to make millions on the internet and you just wanna make a little bit. Well, guess what? Even doing that is going to take effort. It's going to take work. So this is your wake-up call. If you guys want to create an online business. If you wanna start any business that is successful, you've gotta change your mindset. You have to understand that it's going to take a deep commitment within. That's why you hear so many people saying, figure out what your why is, what's your why? What's the reason behind growing an online business? Because the reality is most people want success overnight when it doesn't happen for them, guess what they do? They quit and they settle. They settle in life. They settle for a job they hate. They settle for a life that they're okay with when they know there's more for them, all right? Here's the thing that I also wanna share with you, back to what I said a second ago. Choose your hard. Choose your hard. You know what's hard? Going to a job that you hate for 30 or 40 years to live on a pension that can't pay the bills still. That's a hard life. That's a hard life, okay? Working in online business for maybe five to 10 years to where you never have to work another day in your life, that's a different type of hard. To me, that's not hard. That's not hard. And the reason that it's so solidified in my mind of what I knew I was gonna start to do and what I'm doing and where I'm taking my business is all based on a belief. It's a mindset. That is why you see some people, you see some marketers, you see some entrepreneurs just killing the game and winning, right? What do, for me personally, what do I do, all right? I don't look at other entrepreneurs at my level for, for inspiration. I look at higher level entrepreneurs. I invest into thousands of dollars worth of courses of people who've gone where I want to go. And every day I commit to learning. And I'm not perfect, you guys. This is not to toot my horn. This is to tell you guys that no matter where you're at in your journey, stop looking for the easy way out. Yes, an online business, even today, is an easier route, in my opinion, than working a job your entire life and, and, and living off a, a pay that is still not gonna cut it. It's not gonna pay the bills. It's not gonna leave a legacy. It's not going to leave anything for your, your, your grandchildren and your grandchildren's children, all right? So I wanna, I wanna share something real quick with you guys, all right? Just as, as something to just reset it just reset, let's just breathe for a second. Let's breathe, okay? 
I don't know what your goals are. I don't know what success means to you, but there's a couple things that I want to share with you. First of all, you have to figure out why you're doing this. Why? It is the driving force that will create success in your, in your life, in your business. It's not this magic button, this finally you found the secret. There is no secret. You are the secret. And the faster you learn that, the faster you're going to start getting results, the faster you're going to have success. Okay. So that's, that's the first thing I wanted to tell you guys is to, to figure out your why. Why do you want success? Why do you want to build a business? What does it mean to you? Why do you want it? All right. And the second thing is this, is this, I have this and I look at this every single day, right? It's just a little sign that I got made, right? And I, I put it up here in my office and I got another one that says, believe, believe. All right. And I've had these before I had any success in my business because I knew, I knew that if I was going to create the business of my dreams, I would have to change my mindset because the results in my life did not reflect what I wanted. They just, they simply weren't there. And that may ring true for you right now. Maybe you're not getting the results you want in the business that you have in, in your, your relationship in your personal life, whatever the case may be. If you want to grow a business, this is what it's going to take. You've got to remind yourself every day of what an entrepreneur is. Entrepreneurs take risk. It's it, by definition, entrepreneurs take risk risks. I see so many people now, they, they want to, Oh, I want to be an entrepreneur. They want to be an entrepreneur, but they're not willing to risk anything to include their time. They're not willing to do it. And so you have to understand you're going to have to sacrifice something. You're going to have to risk something to get the results that you want. You see on the other side of risks and on the other side of taking a chance on yourself is the success that you want. I, I see it every day. People don't want to do it. Well, I just want the fast road. I, I just want the fast road and I want it now. Well, get in line with millions of other people who will never get what they want in this life. It's the people who do what other people aren't willing to do now to live a life later that other people will never get to live. The faster you figure that out, the faster success is coming. And so this was just on my heart, you guys, because I, I continue to see this as a trend. All right. I was guilty of it too. When I first started years ago at trying many different things, I tried, I tried with affiliate marketing, ClickBank, other programs, program after program. I tried to spend as little as possible out of my wallet. I didn't want to invest in my business. I didn't have that much to invest and I didn't want to spend the time. I didn't want to commit and guess what? That was when I had zero results. That was when my business wasn't growing. That's when I wasn't thriving. That's when I wasn't making an impact in the lives of other people. But something changed along the way when I, I finally figured out that if my life was going to change financially and, and personally, I was going to have to change. A lot of people don't want to change. And if you don't change, if you don't change, Nothing in your life will change to include your business, to include your wallet. It just won't. Right. And I know that everyone who wants to build a business wants to make more money, right? That is the, the point of a business. That is the definition of a business. Businesses make money. And the sad reality is most people don't do what it takes to actually become a business, which means turn a profit. You've got to turn a profit. And here's the problem. The, the, the way that we build our businesses online, it takes time. It takes time. I don't know how long it's going to be till you make your first sale. It may be a week. It may be a month. It may be a year. And so I'll bring you back just to relate to you guys. So you understand that success is not overnight. I went six months, six months without making continual sales, residual income in my business, working on my business. Okay. And I do believe it was about a year of action of trying to make this work before I actually started to turn a profit. What are you willing to give up? How much time and effort are you willing to put in to, to achieve your dream life, your dream income, your freedom? What does it mean to you? How hard are you willing to work for it? All right. And I just heard, uh, one of, 
one of the entrepreneurs I follow, uh, I forget where it was, but he mentioned that recreation, I forget what it was, recreation, if you're an entrepreneur, for, for a lot of us, recreation, you, you may wanna go out to the bar, you go out to the park with friends, you, you meet up for dinner, I don't know. If you're unhappy with where your business and your life is at, you don't have time for recreation. You gotta prioritize. And the reason that I say that is only for those people who complain. They complain, they want it to be easier, and at the same time, they're out, out at the bar with their buddies complaining about how they wish it was easier to create success. When instead they could be using their time wisely and actually taking action to grow their business, maybe investing into their mind and changing their mindset. You have to understand something. Success is 90%, 90% a mind game. It's 90% mindset. And, and I'm telling you, you guys, because I did the same stupid things that most entrepreneurs do when they're first getting started. I did it. And as a matter of fact, I, I still do stupid stuff all the time. For example, okay, I'm in the Pacific Northwest. We just got hammered with a ton of snow, all right? I even missed a couple of days of work, right? And I had hours upon hours upon hours to work on my business. And instead, I didn't do anything. I literally did nothing. Okay, I did a couple things. But the time that I could have invested into my business, I didn't do it. And so what did I do? Is, is that the end all be all? Is my business done? Do I just quit? No. This is the thing. Entrepreneurs hit roadblocks. Entrepreneurs have setbacks. But entrepreneurs get back up and continue moving forward. You've got to figure it out. You've got to figure out your mindset. Because here's the reality. The sooner you do it, the sooner you do it, you figure out that you are the key to your success, everything's gonna change for you. Everything's gonna change for you. All right, I feel like I'm rambling at this point. I wanted to get this message out there for, I know some people needed to hear this, and of course, share this if you know other people need to hear it as well. This is Nathan with Freedom Influencer. I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye for now.